EPOC study explores prenatal influences on childhood health. Although previous research has shown that a woman's lifestyle during pregnancy is linked to the health of her child, there's remarkably little evidence that those links are causal and are not just correlated. For example, it looks like mums who drink a small amount of alcohol during pregnancy tend to have slightly smaller babies than mums who don't drink, but we don't know whether maternal drinking directly increases the risk of a small baby, because other factors could be having an influence, such as socioeconomic position or other aspects of maternal lifestyle and diet. At the same time, men have been largely left out of this kind of research, and many people might assume that a dad's behaviour can affect the health of his unborn child. But is this true? For example, we know that lifestyle factors like smoking or drinking can affect sperm quality, but does this have an effect on child health? And to what extent do interactions between mums and dads in the prenatal period have an effect? For example, is there a benefit of both parents quitting drinking during pregnancy? EPOC is addressing the urgent need for better quality scientific evidence on how the health behaviours of both mums and dads in the prenatal period might affect the health of their children. We're combining existing data on hundreds of thousands of people from several large European studies. And using this information, we're studying whether parents smoking, drinking alcohol, drinking caffeine, keeping physically active and eating high fat and high sugar diets are causally related to lots of different measures of health and development in children, such as height and weight, body fat, behaviour and even how well the children do at school. And where it looks like there is a causal effect, we're also going to try to work out whether it's the mum's lifestyle, the dad's or a combination that's the most important. Our findings will be vital for producing robust scientific evidence that can be used to develop clearer, less misleading, more effective health advice to both parents in the important prenatal period and we hope that this will help maximise the health of the whole family. EPOC is led by me, Dr Gemma Sharp, at the MRC Integrative Epidemiology Unit at the University of Bristol and it's funded by a new investigator research grant from the Medical Research Council. You can find out more about EPOC, including our findings, at our blog, epoch.blogs.bristol.ac.uk or on our Twitter and Instagram pages at epoch underscore study.